the cute little ducks. <laughs> Look at them. They're so cute. They're teeny. Oh my gosh, they are freaking little. This is right by our house. We live right over here. Oh, don't chase away your baby. Hey guys! So today, um, Tucker and I are heading to one of our first uh, baby showers. So yes, we are having two. So we're just hitting our first one. So right now, um, I'm just eating some food, some cereal, waiting for Tucker to get home. And then we get to go pick up his mom and his sisters and drive up to my sister's house, which is in Colville. So it's really pretty drive, but it's kind of long and I'm a little nervous about traffic, so we have to be there at seven. Um, and we have to pick up his family at six. So hopefully we get there in time. But yeah, so I'm just waiting for Tucker. Um, I got home from work, I had to clean up my car. I had some, a whole bunch of blankets and kind of garbage in it. So I cleaned up my car so people could fit. <laughs> so yeah, so we're just waiting and then we'll hop in the car and we'll go pick up his mom. Up to going, sorry, it's kind of dark. We're now going up to my sister's house. There's Tucker. Came home. I am home. <laughs> um, we got his parents. They're, you probably can't even see it, but they're they're driving behind us. Um, anyways, we're going up to my sister's house, which I said um, is in Colville. So it's going to take us a little bit to get in there. Plus, we hit traffic, and plus, I took the wrong turn and we need to get gas. So, we're running a little bit behind, but that's okay. We're excited. We're excited to see the stuff that Bobby gets today, huh? So anyways, but yeah, so we'll show you what I am focused on the road. He's focused. A ton of crazy he's focused on driving. Like he should be, because he's a good husband. Bunch of crazy. Anyways, so yeah, we're getting excited. Hey guys, it's me. Um, so I we had our baby shower over the weekend on Friday. And we totally forgot to record it. Um, but we were going to, and Tucker came up, but he went um, shooting with my brother-in-law and brother and dad so he went up shooting while we had the baby shower but since we were able to record it we're going to make sure we record the next one which is here in a few weeks so we do have that coming but i did want to show some things so that show the things that she did get because they're so cute so anyways um i'll start showing what I, she got but we got this cute little rattler um what else Oh yeah, one of these teethers, which when my sister had her kids, I loved giving these to her kids, like, because we would stick them in the fridge or the freezer, and they'd just be cold on their gums, so it's going to be really nice when she starts to teeth. Um, what else? Oh, my, um, aunt? My husband's aunt? <laughs> I don't know what she is to me, my aunt-in-law. Anyways, she got us a whole bunch of stuff, like, the stuff they gave us is super sweet, and if you, any, like... I love drafts. Like, I have a huge fetish with drafts. Like, I have drafts on her toy box that Tucker's grandpa made. I painted that draft up over there. So, I love drafts. <laughs> and um, my husband's aunt gave us these cute little draft toys. It, like, rattles. And then this one has wheels and it rolls. So, she got us these cute little draft toys. Um, what else? Oh, yeah, we got some binkies for her. Um, some wash, um, some baby food for later, <laughs> not a whole bunch, but for later, and then my little niece, she's like obsessed with horses, she's four, and, um, not just any horses, unicorns, she's like in her unicorn stage, so she bought our little girl this cute little unicorn, or she didn't buy it, her mom bought it, but she has a matching one, and she is so excited to play unicorns with our little girl <laughs> so I thought that was super cute um and then we got this cute draft book it's a little draft it's really soft I was like really surprised how soft it was anyway so it's a cute little ABC book that we got again from Tucker's aunt and then we got these cute drool bibs that are cut that are in the little they look like handkerchiefs kind of so we got some of those we got two of them and 
Um, oh my gosh, I saw this on Target for my registry, and I want. I was like, oh my gosh, she has to have it. But it's a giraffe binky. <laughs> How cute is that? I think they're called Wubba Nubs. Anyways, so it's a giraffe, and it's a little binky. I'm so excited. I loved it so much. So she got that. And then, um, this is cool. This is a, um, I saw the tags on it. Um, it's like a toy teether. So it has soft, um, rubber and then it has wood on it. And I guess my sister-in-law, or not my sister-in-law, my stepsister was saying that when little kids or babies are teething, that they, like, wood is actually good because it helps when they bite on it, it's harder and then helps to relieve pressure um, in their teeth and in their gums. So I was like, oh, that's cool. So anyways, and it's also kind of like a little rattler toy. And then, um, she got this spiral car seat activity toy with a giraffe. It's so cute. So yeah, we'll have to put this on her car seat and it has cute little as a mirror and a little rattler and a little chew thing here. So I thought that was super cute that she also got. Um, and she got some headbands. Yay! I love headbands on babies. I think it's so cute. So she got some headbands. Um, she got a cute book about animals. So that's a cute little book that she got. And then um, Tucker's aunt also crocheted us some burp cloths of giraffes. So here's our first burp cloth that has a whole bunch of giraffes on it. And then she gave us this one. And she crocheted all these, so that's kind of cool. She gave us that one. And this giraffe, which is cool because then you stick this one over their head. And I was like, no way. So anyways, so there's that one too that we got. And I'm not kidding, like, I love drafts. Like, her, she has clothes that has drafts. And Tucker's, Tucker's mom made us this draft blanket with a um, burp cloth of a draft. <laughs> like, I'm, 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 like, dead serious when I say I love drafts. Anyways, and then, um, oh, this is awesome. So, my stepmom and stepsister gave us this amazing blanket. It's huge. Um, has, um feathers and then just this anyways but it's it's a really big blanket as you can tell it's huge and it's made from swaddle the swaddle blanket materials and she was saying that it's like layered with swaddle blanket materials and she said her son um loved this when they were younger and it's gonna be nice because when winter time comes or even fall time this is gonna be a really nice like winter blanket for her um, anyways, and it just looks super cute. So I'm super, I'm super excited. I just love it so much. <laughs> so that, that's some of the stuff she got. And then we got the, some wipes and some diapers. And then her clothes. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. I love little baby clothes. So she got this cute little onesie that says little cutie on it. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> so she got that one. And then she got... And a lot of these come with, like, pants, so it's, like, a full-on outfit. Oh, and cool thing I learned the other day is that I always thought... I wonder if you could see... Oh, yeah. No, I'll show it on this one. Hi! Hello. There's Tucker! He's awake! <laughs> we were... He took a nap, and I was taking a nap. We kind of crashed. Oh, I was so tired. We were so tired. But anyways, I'm just showing all the stuff she got. Come and join Anyways, but cool little thing, I realized, so I always thought these, like, little, like, designs or whatever, or these little things on onesies were just the design of the shirt. No, it's totally so that if your baby has a blowout or, like, they pee everywhere, it's so that you don't have to unclip it and take it up over their head. It's so that you can pull it down over them. I was so amazed. I was like, what? I totally, in all these years of changing babies and doing all this stuff like I've always unbuttoned the bottoms and taken up like nasty poops like up over their heads and so that was a cool little trick I learned so if you didn't know that that's what it's for it's so it can stretch give more extra fabric so it can stretch over their shoulders and head and then you don't have to pull it up over him so anyways that's my little tip trick of the day that I learned and then she got these cute little pants and look has a ruffle bum <laughs> I have a little, little ruffle bum that can go with her her clothes. 
And then she got these cute pants. One second. Okay. I'll be back. <laughs> and then she got this. So this shirt and these see like they're kind of like outfits. They go together and it could go with the pink pants. But I loved this shirt. Isn't it so cute? Oh my gosh. And I washed all these yesterday so they're all clean and ready to go. So yeah, she got that shirt. Oh, and then so this. So all these were her like, let's see, six months. Um, let's look. Yeah. So I, I've always, I've separated like out all of her clothes in her closet. So it's like zero to three, three to six, six to nine. Um, just so that they're a lot easier to organize and find. So these, these ones that I just showed you, those are all of her six months. Not all of them. Like she has a ton more, but from the baby jar, all of her six months that she got. And then I think these are, this is way awesome. Um, my stepsister and stepmom also gave me this, but they're like the new, um, nursing covers, car seat covers and, um, grocery shopping cart covers. Oh, I thought it was so cool. Anyways. And it's really pretty. I really like the design of it. Anyway, so it's, it's an easy like slip on. So you just, so there's like, the bigger hole down here and then like the smaller one up here and so for nursing you just slip it on over your head and it's super lightweight and really thin so it's gonna be really nice for the summer so I'm not like she's not dying of heat I'm not dying of heat in the summer and then um, it goes over the car seats as well and then my stepsister said that you could put it in the shopping cart to where I still have to figure it out but like this the hole that usually goes over your head goes is where like their legs go through in the shopping cart so you like set them in there and then all of the it kind of protects against germs and it um like catches food or toys if they're playing with it while they're in the shopping cart she says you can also use it for like high chairs at restaurants so that i thought that was really cool and i really like how it looks i think it's really pretty and i i wanted one of these really bad because i like the ones that are just like the covers that you just throw over like if it's windy and they just like blow up, it's like, hello world. So <laughs> I like how there's this, so you just have a little more coverage as well as it's super cute. And then you can put it on her car seat or her car seat as well. So we got, we got that, which I just love. And then she got a whole bunch of cute little stockies. Let's see, sorry, I thought the stocker going in. Let's pull up her socks down. I'm still missing a sock. I think I got stuck in like one of our clothes and our laundry. So I have to go through it and try to find her teeny little sock. Because I don't want to miss it. Anyway, so yeah, she got a whole bunch of cute little socks. And then um, she got, so this little like diaper cover goes with one of her dresses that she got. Um, and she got some cute blue pants. And I love all this stuff. I'm like crazy about it. And look how cute. Oh my gosh. It's a little um, elephant and it says mommy's girl. <laughs> so I can put that with the blue pants or whatever. So that's super cute. I love that. She did that. And then she got this. Of course it has drabs and elephants. It's an interesting shirt. It has bunnies, cupcakes, drafts, and elephants. Like what? <laughs> like you would think like you would put more like safari themed animals together but I guess not but it's still super cute and I love it so she has that one and these are all like her zero to three so that's gonna be really nice she has a ton of those and I'm really happy and then she got this cute one that has little I don't know if you can see but it has little hearts on it and little sparkly hearts so oh yeah so like so like they have these little like diaper diaper covers and then it goes with this dress so she has a cute little butterfly dress and then these little diaper covers go underneath it, underneath it. So that's going to be fun. And nice, really nice for the summertime. And then she got some cute little pajamas. Tucker and I were like geeking out the other day because this is a newborn. Yeah, this is a newborn pajama onesie. And she's going to be teeny in this. Like, she's not going to have her legs in here. <laughs> like, they're all going to be scrunched up. And it's going to look so cute. So that's her cute little newborn um onesie and then that blue the blue um let's see this little blue diaper cover goes with this dress this cute flower pink dress and it's cute because they have little pockets in it so she has that cute pink dress 
And then here's this diaper cover, and this one goes with this dress. So she got a lot of dresses, and I love it because she needed some more dresses. <laughs> and then she just got these cute little um, pants with the ruffles on it. So that's this we got a while ago. But yeah, so that's kind of all the stuff she got from this baby shower. And then again, we have another baby shower two weeks from now, and we will make sure we record that one because... <laughs> We were kind of went psh at the last one. So anyways, that's the cute thing she got. And I just wanted to show you how cute they were because I love them all and I'm super excited. We're getting so much closer. I mean, May is almost over and then it's going to, oh, sorry, then it's going to be June. And then she comes and I'm so excited. But anyway, so yeah, so we had so much fun with the baby shower. We did a fun, tons of fun games. Um, my sister provided a whole bunch of fruits and cookies and um, cotton like small jars of cotton candy and it was it was really good and I am a huge cherry fan so she brought cherries <laughs> so yeah we played some really fun like guest games oh and have you ever played those games where they like scramble up the words and you have to unscramble them yeah I suck at those so I was trying there was like 19 of them and I got three and I was like and like when they were going through the saying what the answers were, and I was like, diapers? How does that say diapers? It does not even look like it would spell the word diapers. Oh, it was really bad. I did so bad on that. But all the other games were really fun. Tucker's mom and sisters all all provided the games and they did an awesome job. It was so fun. And then like I said, Tucker went up hunt or not hunting, he went up shooting. He uh shot my brother's sniper and things like that. It was it was kind of funny my after the party my Dad comes in and puts his arm around me, and he's like, so, your husband scoped himself. I'm like, what? He scoped himself? And he's like, yeah, he hit himself with the scope. I was like, oh, no. And so I guess um, I'll see if Tucker, I'll see if Tucker. Let's see if he can come in. Because you should see, he, like, got himself right there. Because you guys, like, who are hunters, you know, like, the scopes. I guess he was, they were trying to shoot. It was getting dark, and um, they were shooting, like, a half mile away, so, like, 800 yards or something. And my brother has this really cool, like, bulletproof metal plate. And so you shoot the gun, and it's silent, and then you hear this ding, like, off in the distance when you hit it. So that was kind of cool. Anyway, so my brother's like, okay, Tuck, you got two more tries. And he's like, okay, I have to make this count. So he gets down there, he gets all, you know, ready, situated, and he's noticing that the... Um, scope is like kind of blurry and he's like oh, okay so he's trying to move his eye like his face closer or farther trying to adjust the blur and so he moved his face too close and so when he shot it went bink and clocked him right in the face and he thought he just got a bump like he didn't know he got a cut it like cut pretty good and so he's like oh, okay and so he's like and he didn't hit he didn't hit the metal plate so he's like okay well I'll try again so he goes to try again and, but then he starts to notice, like, it being wet and blood drooling down the side of his face. And he's like, okay, either I can get up and call it good, or I can just take one last shot. And knowing Tucker, he has to take one last shot. He can't just call it quits. So he goes, he lines it back up, and he shoots. And then he just kind of, like, stands up, doesn't think he got to get it. And then he says, tink, and he totally nailed it and turned around. He's like, look, guys, and they're all laughing because he totally got scoped. And so, yeah, it's a pretty deep cut, and it kept bleeding, but now it's it's healing and doing better, but he got his first scope in the face, so that was kind of funny. Anyways, so that's kind of, oh, I forgot one more outfit. This one! So it's a cute little plaid shirt with some jeans. Um, This is more, this is a 12 month, so she can start to wear this when she's like one, um, one and a half or whatever, depending on how big or small she is. <laughs> Might dig her a little while. Because I don't think she's going to be that big of a baby. Because I'm not that big and I'm already 31 weeks. So <laughs> we'll see how big she is when the day comes. But let's go. I want to go show you Tucker's scoped face. Because it's uh, kind of funny. So let me go show you. Hey, hon. Uh, co come show them your scoped face. Where are you? Oh, what are you looking for? Oh, uh, your black one? Mm -hmm. mm. He's looking for his computer, I guess. His black laptop. Anyways, come show him your scope. See? I told him the story. I don't know if you can see. Right there. So, yeah, I was shooting. I was Boom! Shooting right he got there, scoped. <laughs> and I got really close. 
and too close because it was like really blurry. So I tried to like get closer, shot the, um, pulled the trigger and then it I hit my them. forehead. I nailed them in the face, but he got his shooting battle. Well, I got it. I found, yeah, I found, I hit the target. He did hit it. So that's, I guess that helps with your scoped face. <laughs> so it was worth it. <laughs> it was worth it. So anyways, I just, like I said, I just wanted to do a quick, quick video of just all the things she got. So I hope you guys are having an awesome day and make sure you subscribe to our channel so you can see more of us and more of the fun things we're doing. And we'll catch you later. Bye.